Hello, boys and girls. We're gonna start working on some projects that remind us of summertime because we're almost there. It's almost summertime. And this is one of my favorite things to do in the summer. And it was my son's favorite book to read when he was about your age. It's called Tiny Goes Camping by Carrie Meister. And it's illustrated by Rich Davis. And I'm not gonna read the whole thing, but basically I just wanted to show it to you because I was very inspired by this first illustration of a lightning bug jar. Do any of you call them lightning bugs or do you call them fireflies? I don't know, but I just thought it was so cool. They really look like they're glowing inside. And if you go through the book, they get all ready to go camping. And there they are singing by the campfire. And then they find a frog, they chase the frog, and then look at what they see here. They see fireflies. And again, the fireflies are glowing. And the art concept that I wanna teach you about the fireflies is that they really most look like they're glowing when we put bright colors next to dark colors. So we're gonna learn how to make some glowing fireflies in a jar today. And it's gonna look a little bit like this. This one was created using watercolors. Now you don't have to use watercolors if you don't have any at home. You can just use color crayons. Um, it's helpful to have a marker to make their heads and their wings and things stand out in the outlines of the jar. Um, but you certainly don't have to use a marker. Um, so I'm going to show you how to draw it in fast motion. Okay, here we go.